Hello everyone, my name is Arden, and welcome back to another video. Yo, so today I'll be taking a look at Pop Marvel number 902 from Marvel Studios Loki, the classic Loki figure. So this figure is was originally exclusive to Box Hunts, but of course I do have the special edition shared sticker here. Um, but I think this figure looks uh, really cool. Um, I was a really big fan of Loki. It's probably still my favorite Marvel Disney Plus show. And I'm excited to see what series coming up in 2022, like Moon Knight and like She-Hulk, uh, will change uh, if a series will actually be able to beat Loki for me. So the front of the box, you have the classic Loki title, of course, there as well as you can see the pop and the pop image there, the number of the figure, and the Loki logo, and that special edition sticker, which I think is a decent sticker, it's just that I have so many of these shared stickers, like Toys R Us gets a bunch of them, so if, if I want to get the exclusive, it's usually with a shared sticker. So to the side, I really like the detail they added here, because in the background behind Classic Loki, you can see the TVA logos, which is really cool. You have the Avengers logo right there, which like I mentioned in my Kid Loki, Funko Shop exclusive video. I thought maybe a Loki logo with like Loki's crowns would have even, or crown would have been better uh, than the Avengers logo. I'm pretty sure they did something like that for What If, but I'm not sure about the other Disney Plus shows. On the uh, back, you have the common wave of figures with Loki, Mobius, Sylvie, President Loki, Ravona, Renslayer with Miss Minutes, and Kid Loki. And then you have Classic Loki again there, and you can see the side of the figure, which looks quite cool. So now I'll just take a figure, the figure out of the box and take a, look, a closer look at it. So here is the pop out of the box, and I think it looks really nice. It's a very tall, normal size figure, especially with that huge crown. The horns on it are really, really large, and I'm quite actually surprised that it was able to stand up fine. Uh, the cape, the uh, all of the outfit with the light, very bright yellow and green looks really nice. I think the expression on this figure is nice as well. I like the arms crossed. The uh, under there, you can see the yellow there. I think it, it all together really looks nice. The crown is really big. I like how this outfit came together. And it's for sure uh, like classic Loki in the show. I think they did a good job while well representing this figure. It's a really tall pop. Um, of course, not like an 18 inch figure, but for a normal size figure, I think my current tallest one maybe without uh, like uh, uh, stand like Star Wars figures. Well, these ones are just standing on the ground. I feel like it's this Dwight and that Dwight is for sure still taller, but this is a uh, very tall figure um and i really like it i uh i'm happy that they made classic loki into a figure i really like classic loki in the loki series i liked his story just drifting away getting lonely and uh i just i really liked classic loki in the series and i thought his like sacrifice at the end putting up the illusion of asgard and having a lieth consume it I thought was really cool so I really liked Loki and I like the series and I like this pop too and it looks even better than I thought it did uh, just from the pictures I really like how the outfit translated the details on it are nice as well and I just really like this figure so that was my review of the classic Loki figure I really like this pop um I think Classic Loki is for sure a good character to have in an exclusive line of figures. Uh, I like figures like this even more than the Kid Loki. I like getting new characters, whereas the Kid Loki is just a bit metallic compared to its common counterpart. So I really like this figure. I'm, I like exclusives that are different characters, and I enjoy Classic Loki in the Loki series. I think the outfit here is really nice. And uh, I, anything with Loki really is going to sell me because I just, he's my favorite Marvel character. Uh, but yeah, I really like this figure and I hope you enjoyed this review and I'll see you in the next one.